Hey guys, Troy again with another pen video, and uh, if you watch my channel and have for any length of time, you know that I like both modern and vintage pens. Here I'm going to show you a modern pen, and uh, yeah, I'm kind of partial to Waterman brand, and here is one as well. This actually is half a Christmas gift. How is half, you might say? Well, um, two different people gave me some gift cards for eBay for Christmas, and I took them both and applied it towards this purchase right here. It was kind of on my radar for a while. I'd seen them, um, and it was uh, something that was on my list of things to be looking for, and I've had many on my wa my watch list over the years. But here we go. It's a Waterman. Um, this is a Harley-Davidson Horizon and uh, this is a very interesting pen. Of course, it's got the medium nib to it, so you know all this before even opening up the box. This was new old stock. I live here in North Carolina in the United States, and uh, this pen was from a North Carolina seller at the coast, and I'm about two hours inland, so I figured, why not? Um, I'd actually tried to uh, bid on one of these from another seller, and uh, I just wasn't winning that, or it was getting to the point where it's more than I thought the bidding was worth. So I went and I kept looking, and I ran across this one. This Harley Davidson uh, collaboration fountain pen, what I really like is, uh, you know, it's got the, the Harley gas tank with a gas cap on it. So it definitely is branded Harley, powered by Waterman. You can see that there on camera, um, but it's a, it's a nice plastic hard shell case that it sits in, and you open it up by lifting up on that gas cap, and you got that foam insert lining there, uh, and here we go. This is you know the number that it was, number eleven thousand five hundred and twenty-three off their assembly line. Comes with a nice little book. It did have a Waterman cartridge with it. Uh, and what I liked, it also came with a Waterman converter. I'll show you that here, and it is a cartridge converter pen. You pull it out, and then you've got this. Uh, kind of, uh, I was told, designed after a piston head. I am not a mechanic. <laughs> but, um, you know, I looked at these, and I thought, you know, I thought that, that's pretty cool. That's pretty unique. These came in several different colors. Um, I, I saw the red ones online. Um, I saw this was also available in blue, and I thought it was either orange or just a horrible picture of the red one not really sure uh, but um, you look at the tail end of the pen and there you go so it's got that shape what I guess uh, the the bottom of a piston um, and then you look at the top you got the clip here very unique clip and it's very serviceable very stiff it's a slip cap Pull that off, and that's a good hefty cap to it, by the way. Kind of heavy. And then you've got the striping right down in here. You get a very short section here, but that's okay because you're really not going to be gripping there. You're going to be gripping right around that. And it's got a beautiful Waterman nib on it. I'll try to get you some better pictures of it. Of course, it's going to be a steel nib, I do believe. Um, but I will tell you, it is the typical Waterman. Um, it's a typical Waterman quality, I would expect, of a nice um, upper end. I've seen these pens go for several hundred dollars. Um, that is not anywhere near what I paid for this one. One of the cool things, you talk about diamond cast. I'm not saying that this is diamond cast, but um, the pictures didn't really show it, but it's nice and sparkly. So the pictures that I saw on the listing. But maybe you can see some of that sparkle right there in on uh, the coating on that barrel. So you screw it off here. So when I say the section is short, I mean like the very end here. But you, this is actually part of the section. But when you go to grip, uh, it's going to be kind of over here. Some people may not like that. That doesn't bother me because my big fingers are going to go over that no matter what either way. And it did have a Waterman converter in with it. So you put that back together. And just this part alone, it's got some good heft to it. And uh, it's one of those things you pick it up, it's like, you know, okay, that feels like a quality pen in the hand. It looks quality. It's a very good looking pen. Um, and uh, of course, it's a limited edition. It's meant to look like something, uh, you know, something that would have been utilitarian. Then you look right here on, uh, right here on the cap, you can see that it does say Waterman and Harley Davidson right on it. 
I'll try to get you some better pictures of that as well. So it's got some good heft to it. Um, I was actually pretty impressed when I went to go pick it up, but when I went to go right with it, that was the real surprise. So when you go to use it, you do have the option to post this particular pen, like most Waterman pens, and it does go on there nice and tight. It's not going anywhere, but I can tell you it back weights that pen significantly because that cap is pretty heavy. But, quite honestly, it is long enough where it fits comfortably in the hand where you don't really need to post it. Uh, obviously, just don't lose your cap. <laughs> but a cap that size and weight, it's going to be a little hard uh, to misplace that baby right there. So let's go take a look on Waterman. Harley Davidson. You know, Waterman was an iconic American brand. Uh, of course, now is a French brand. Um, Harley Davidson, of course, an iconic motorcycle brand. Uh, the two together just make for a very nice pen. I actually have a uh, Waterman Cool Tour here in my collection that's got um, a Harley Davidson uh, theme to it, uh, but it's not, you know, aimed like this. It's not uh, an upper end pen. It's definitely a lower end pen. But this has a beautiful medium smooth I mean buttery smooth beautiful nib writes very very well I was quite happy as soon as I put pen to paper I was thinking you know what that is just awesome if you like the Waterman perspective or maybe the exception I really think that you're gonna like this pen right here um, I don't know if you like the, the gimmick or the special edition kind of thing, but if you like a good, smooth, modern pen that writes very, very well, um, then you're going to like this particular pen. I mean, uh, definitely the, the Perspective is about the same league, but probably at a much better price point than the Perspective, because you can actually find these uh, somewhere around $100. Uh, some sellers were going $125, and I've seen them as high as $200 and some. Depends on who, from whom you buy. Mine was new old stock, so with the price I was able to get it, I went ahead and snatched it, and I said that's what I'm going to get. Uh, so, what did I put into this pen? I put into some... I don't know if I'm spelling Farnies right. F-A-H-R-N-E-Y-S. I probably spelled that wrong. Uh, but some Farnies uh, Raven Black. Farnies, I don't know who makes their inks for them, but um, this actually is a pretty good black ink. I'm always on the lookout for some good black ink. Uh, but the last time I ordered from Farnies, um, um, I went ahead, well, was it the time before last? Well, anyway, uh, when I went to go order from Farnies, I actually uh, added on a bottle of black ink. It was on sale. And, uh, you know, a nice good bottle of Raven Black. Looks very good. Works very well. Very happy with, I mean, this pen just glides across the page. And I've used this on all kinds of different paper. This was my pen of the day for a while. Um, well, so maybe it was more like my pen of the week kind of thing. I was able to show it to some folks and um, yeah, online, as a, on an online uh, pen club meetup, and uh, I think they all like the look of it. And I tell you what, if they can get their hands on one, I think they're going to like the feel of it as well. But very, very happy. So the Waterman Harley Davidson, reminiscent, uh, you know, of, of their Harley engine. And just a great, great pen in my collection. I was really glad that I picked this one up.